Welcome back. So today is the last day to get to the Northwest Folklife Festival. King 5's Jordan Wilkerson joins us this morning from the Seattle Center with more. Hi, Jordan. Hey, Joyce. Yeah, it's the 48th year, and so I'm going to be joining the Executive Artistic Director. This is Kelly Ferriar, and tell me a little Hi. bit about this year and maybe the theme that you guys have. This year we have been celebrating and amplifying youth voices through our cultural focus, Youth Rising. Mm, and yes. what exactly does that that mean to you? There's going to be uh, many great performances, music, visual arts, mm -hmm. um, dance, um, and this is all curated by the youth uh, from around the Pacific that Northwest. That is so cool. And you yeah. were telling me, I was asking how many people will be here throughout the weekend because it started <laughs> Friday right. and it ends today. So today's the last day. But how many performers do you have throughout the weekend? We have over 730 plus performers. Wow. Performances coming. Um, but within that, it's over 5,000 performers that oh come my out gosh. who are donating their time ta and talents. That is so cool. Okay, so for someone who's never come to this before, yes. kind of explain what happens when you get here. I, I see, obviously, a lot of tents set up. There's a lot of tents. Um, you can grab a program guide mm -hmm. um, at our entrances and kind of pick out a few things that you are excited to see. Okay. And the best thing about folk life is once you show up, you'll find many other things that you discover. Instruments, songs, dances, cool. friends, neighbors. A little bit of everything. A little bit of everything that represent the Northwest. And I heard it's donation based. Like it if is they definitely, come in. yes. Based so on donations. That. Okay. Um, the festival is built by and for the community. Um, not only are performers donating their time, but when people arrive on grounds, we ask you to make your best donation possible. That is so nice. So yeah. it's accessible for pretty much everyone. Yes, yes. For 48 years, it's been accessible. No gates, no tickets. That's awesome. Okay, yeah. so what is the timeline for today? When does everything start? Everything gets going um, at 11 a.m. today okay. and goes down at 9 p.m. All and right. It's a beautiful day. Sounds good. Yeah, it's going to be really nice. I'm sure Rich will have your forecast in just a minute. But reporting live from Seattle Center, Jordan Wilkerson, King 5 Mornings. All right. Thank you, Jordan.